Hello everybody, this is Chris Nelson with Go Engineer, and in today's video we will be learning how to use the circular sketch pattern tool. First, click the entities you would like to pattern, and click this drop down in the sketch toolbar, selecting circular sketch pattern. By default, the origin is the center of rotation, but click this box, and you will be able to choose any point you would like. Underneath that box, we can choose specific X and Y positions. Next is the arc length box. By default, your parts will be equally spaced across 360 degrees, but you can modify that. By clicking the dimension angular spacing, it will give the amount of degrees between each specific part. This box allows us to change the number of instances. Let's add five. We also can use a polar coordinate system to designate the center. By changing these two boxes, we can change the radius of the center and the angle of the center in relation to the first instance. I've changed both these values to 45, and you can see it is updated accordingly. Lastly, we have the Entities to Pattern box. If we choose other entities, it will add them to the circular sketch pattern. Once we are happy, we can click the green sketch mark, and the sketch has been updated. I hope you found the SOLIDWORKS tutorial video useful. If you would like to continue improving your skills in SOLIDWORKS, enroll in one of our online training courses at GoEngineer.